vanity. <laughs> Lord, and welcome back to their ep welcome back to my doorbell. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's Lord, and welcome back to another episode of DIY Mister. It's been a hot minute. I don't even know what episode this is. Honestly, I have to go check on my channel. But by the time I write the title, I will know what episode it is. But I'm super excited because I've been meaning to do this DIY for a solid two or three years now. And so I know that I'm a little behind the trend. I feel like this was popular kind of a long time ago, but I still want one. I still really want a cloud light. So we're gonna make it happen. I've watched some tutorials, I've watched some videos. It doesn't seem difficult. I've got all the necessities. I couldn't find a big one of these, so we've got three just in a row. We're making a cumulonimbus cloud. <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea. <laughs> Didn't do super hot in science. Let me know what kind of cloud this is if you know your clouds. I don't, but we're gonna make a cloud light and I'm super excited. I've got a bunch of stuffing of cloud material and we go make a cloud light. Okay, so I feel like the easy part is gonna be sticking these together. I just feel like, you know, there shouldn't be an issue. Mias, yes. Mias. Yes. Okay, here we go, here we go. Here we go. So if you guys remember, I'm working on like a chill yoga, like tranquil environment room. This is so on brand for this room that I hope it super works out. I'm scared to touch the glue because I feel like it's gonna be really hot through like, this is like a tissue paper. Oh my god, yeah, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot. Ah, ah, ah. Also, my hand doesn't fit in this one, why not? Ah! Does that seem like this can hold this one up too, or is it gonna be lumpy? I'm a little nervous about this. I just foresaw this going so much easier from the get-go, I think. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Maybe once I attach it with some fluff here, it'll help, like, hold them together. Well, I guess that's not too bad. Wow, hot glue doing the most. You guys know, I love hot glue. Like, live and die by hot glue. And like, I trust it, but I don't, you know? So I'm gonna add just like a little bit of a felt reinforcement here, just to help strengthen this little situation happening here. Did not see this in a tutorial, so probably don't even need to do this, but I'd rather have my cloud be in one piece than my cloud to just like break apart in the sky and fall on my head later on. Ah, so thin. <laughs> Almost said words of profanity. <laughs> it's still hot. It's still hot. Didn't learn the first time. It's like, what's that? That whole analogy about touching the stove burned you, burned, burned, burned lots of times there. <laughs> ah! Oh. Oh yeah. I think this is the longest part. Is making our cloud into a cloud with the fluff, with the floofies, with the floofies of the floofies. But apparently we just, it's just like a, like a glue and stick type of situation. This breaks apart so easily, so I'm worried about how it's gonna stick to each other, I guess? Okay, let's do it. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, go. <laughs> I don't even know where to start. Uh, okay, here we go. Committing, committing to my cloud. Like, is this too big? Is it cloud yet? No. Is it cumulonimbus? There's is that a, the cloud that I'm looking for? It's from, like the Simpsons the, cloud. That's from the up. Remember when he was like, I know what cloud that is. That's a cumulonimbus. What does a cumulo... Okay, check it out. Nope. What does a cumulus nimbus cloud look like? Wow. We're about to learn so much. Also, I'm on a, I'm on a, a science page for kids right now. Cumulus nimbus! <laughs> I think it's just a, a cumulus cloud. Oh. My piece is too large. Yeah, like I feel like that probably isn't supposed to happen. Oh my god, imagine I ripped a hole in this. That would be so tragic. I only have three. Smaller pieces, smaller pieces. Okay, and also I have um, a safety glove <laughs> to go inside. Oh yeah, <laughs> I got nothing on me. We've updated the glove to a spoon. <laughs> There's like this wire at the top here and I just can't get my hand in. But like, that's perfect. DIY is all about improvising. Look at us improvising with kitchen utensils. Ah! Uh, 
update. I'm sweating. I broke one and a half glue guns out of two. I'm running out of fluff and I'm hungry. <laughs> also, I'm realizing this is gonna take kind of a long time. I feel like I've been fluffing for a half hour and we're maybe like, I guess maybe like a third done. It looks pretty good though. Like she looking cloudy. She looking cumulusy. <laughs> cumulusly nimby. <laughs> Every scientist right now or anyone that knows anything about clouds is like, no girl, just no. Yo guys, my cloud thick. <laughs> it's so big. We're like definitely a little bit past the halfway point now. Oh, look at my little glue string hanging. Great. Also, like, you have no idea how heavy cotton batting ends up getting randomly. Also, I've got both glue guns going, so when this one kind of like craps out, I switch to this one, and then when this one craps out, I go to this one, and I'm just really sad because this glue gun has been with me for years. He's been my dad's. This is an antique. It's vintage. But I have to be so mad that I'm referring to him as like vintage. <laughs> sort of. This is like, gotta be at least seven pounds. I'm a little concerned. Oh no, is this side heavier? Are we leaning? We're definitely leaning. This side's definitely heavier. Oh no! <laughs> Whoa, okay. I'm gonna floof it up a little bit so it doesn't look so much like a white poop. Kinda looks like a poop right now, right? Looks a little bit like a poop. It's just so, like so uniform. Like clouds need to be like more billowy on one side. Also, I'm planning on adding some lights in the inside. A lot of the tutorials that I saw were like storm clouds, but, that's not my vibe. I feel like some, maybe some fairy lights could be cute, but also like, I'm kind of just down with it just being like a cloud. So, I don't know. But like, dang, we made a cloud, y'all. Okay, so I, I have about 30 feet of firefly lights, the Brandon Wolfel in me. And I was like, oh, maybe it'll be cute. Like it's a daylight thing. It's like a little like mini, like floaty fairy cloud light. But uh, look what happens when you put the lights on. And power! Nothing, nothing happens. <laughs> There's so many lights happening inside and like maybe at night it would be cute, but I kind of want it to be just more like a daytime thing. So like, I'm kind of over the lights. And I mean, it works, don't get me wrong. Like, we have light, but I think I'm just gonna make a hanging cloud. Does this still count as a DIY master? <laughs> I just like don't want to make a storm cloud with like purple and blue and green and stuff. I want it to be like cute and like fairy lighty. But maybe we'll just like hang those up in the actual room and just hang the cloud up. It's time to hang up the flying poop. I'm gonna make it so it's not so poop like and more cloud like, but it's time. Also, this is possibly the sketchiest ladder in the entire world. So Matt, you're you're doubling as cameraman and and uh, spotter. Okay, I got you from back here. <gasps> uh, oh no. What's it doing? Besides falling off right here. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. Ah! What needs to happen? That needs to be good. Good. This way? Yeah. A little bit more. A little bit more. Let's see how she looks. Oh, that's actually kind of cute. That's the bad side. I want to flip it around. <laughs> <laughs> Literal head in the clouds. Rotate. Rotate. So basically just this corner is cute now, but ta-da! My floating poop is now a cloud in the sky! So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of DIY. 
If there are any other DIYs you'd like to see me attempt to tackle, make sure to leave them in the comments down below. This was kind of a selfish DIY master because I was kind of decorating my own room. But if there's anything specific you want me to try, make sure to let me know. Thank you so much to the Pretty Little Lore of the Week. Thank you so much for supporting Lore DIY products, and I hope you're having so much fun getting creative. All my socials will be linked in the down bar below. And make sure to check out all the other episodes of DIY Master. I will see you guys on Wednesday for Weebon and Santa for another sun. D I W. Okay, bye guys. Love you. I'm the DIY queen. That's the royal elite. My pretty little kingdom out here running the streets. DIY.